Let's take a look at the multiplication questions. Questions one to seven are non-calculator and the remaining questions you are able to use a calculator. They're obviously a bit easier. Um, so question number one, Tom has 13 boxes of pens which have eight pens in each. So how many does he have in total? Well, the calculation is 13 times eight. I would use uh, a written method like this. Three times eight is 24. Four, carry the two. One times eight is eight plus the two is 10, so in total 104. Seven times 22, again, I would use a written method, 22 times by seven, I'd set it out like this. Uh, seven twos are 14, four, carry the one, two sevens are still 14, plus the one is 15, so that comes to a total of 154. Four times 26, 26 times four. Again, if you're multiplying two numbers where um, there's a different number of digits. I'd always put the, um, the the number which is fewer digits on the bottom. So I do uh, four four on the bottom, not not twenty six on the bottom. Uh, four sixes are twenty four, so that's four. Carry the two. Two fours are eight. Plus the two is ten. So that is a total of one hundred and four. Forty one times eight. Forty one on the top. Eight on the bottom. One eight is eight. 4, 8, 8, 16, 24, 32. So the answer is 328. 9 times 68, I'll turn it into 68 times 9, keeping the single digit number on the bottom. 8 nines, well, that's a little bit nasty. Um, 8 nines are 72, so that's 2 carry 7. 6 nines, that's also uh, not terribly pleasant, but that's uh, 54. 54 plus 7, that's the same as 57 plus 4, is 61. So the answer is 612. So Charlotte sells 25 boxes and there's 16 muffins per box. So it's 25 times 16. We've got two two digit numbers. So it really doesn't matter which number goes on the bottom or the top. Six times five is 30. So that's zero carry the three. Two sixes are 12 plus the three is 15. Now we're gonna repeat the process using the one, but before we do that, we need to put in a zero um, on the second line because this is the one of 10. One five is five, one times two is two. Add these numbers together, zero. Five plus five is 10, zero carry the one. Two plus one is three, plus one is four. So in total, 400 muffins. 42 times 31, two, two digit numbers, so it doesn't really matter which way around they go. One times two is two, one times four is four. Repeat the process with the three, but put in a zero because this is the three of 30. Three twos are six, three fours are 12. Add these two numbers together. Two plus zero is two. Four plus six is 10, zero carry the one. Two plus one is three, one plus nothing is one. So one, three, zero, two. So now we can use a calculator. Very easy, just type in 44, hit the multiplication symbol, 48, and you'll get the answer to one, one, two. 65 times 39, use the same method on the calculator, literally just type in what you see here and you get the total 2535. For question 10, you should get the answer 1656. And for question 11, 3774. Question 12 and 13, again, using the calculator, just type it in 52, hit the multiplication sign, 59, then hit the equal sign, you'll get 3068. And if you do exactly the same thing with 64 and 64, you should get the answer 4096.